data volumes continue to surge in government data centers, a trip to the Computer History Museum can show you a bit about the history of your data and maybe some insight into the evolution and where it's going. The term big data describes massive amounts of information you keep, but data is useless if you can't store it. That big data has to live somewhere. Um, they could be on hard disk drives, which would be fast and expensive and take a lot of energy, or could be sitting on tape drives, which means slow access but high capacity and, and low energy cost. Seeing old storage media at the museum may take you back to the early days of your career. Remember your old floppy? How about your zip drive? Do people in your jurisdiction still use punch cards? Optical media, like the compact disc, are probably fresher in your mind. As you know, just because something's older doesn't mean it's not useful. So you would think that by the time hard disks come around, you wouldn't really use it anymore. Well, you still use it for very high uh, capacity applications, uh, for backups, and even today, uh, whereas most home users don't deal with tape, most large enterprises, of course, have massive amounts of tape storage. For more technology news, read Government Technology Magazine and visit govtech.com.